We all know the story of Seti, but what about before they became a couple? Were they enemies or were they really friends? Here's the full story of how Sam and Freddy became frenemies. Keep your hands off my AV equipment! You mean I can't play with the white balance on your superty duperty camcorder? <laughs> ah, sure! Everybody jokes about the white balance till the skin tones go magenta! When starting iCarly, Freddy's tech skills were obviously needed. Four! Oh people of Earth. <laughs> I'm Carly Shay, and this is our very first webcast of a little show we call iCarly. But Sam wasn't happy with Freddy hopping on board the iCarly train. You're gonna need a technical producer, right? Set up the lights, audio, work the camera. Aww, he wants to be our geek. <laughs> yeah! You got a big mouth, lady! The two constantly bickered and argued. Oh, you're human, human. but I deserve you deserve a brain! At least I have a brain! Oh, no, you don't have a brain, you have no sense! <laughs> but the biggest blowout? When Sam revealed Freddy's secret live on iCarly. Freddy's never kissed a girl. Never, not once. I heard him say so myself, and Carly's a witness. That was totally not cool, Sam. But Sam made it up to Freddy with an apology. On the last night, Carly, I told you guys that Freddy never kissed anyone. And that was really personal, and I shouldn't have said it on the show. And for all you people out there who've been teasing Freddy about it, lay off. Because I bet a whole lot of you haven't kissed anyone either. Including me. And a kiss. Well, that was, um... Nice? Yeah, nice, uh... Good work. Thank you, you too. But a kiss didn't stop the two of them from arguing. <laughs> hey, could you keep your hands off my equipment over there? I could, but I don't think I will. And neither did having to share locker 239. <laughs> Dude, what up? What did you do to my locker? My locker! Our locker! When did you turn into my wife? <laughs> but there was a moment of truce when Missy came along. Tell me one reason why I should believe you. Because I came here. Have I ever come to you for help before? For anything? Freddy selflessly gave up his prize to help Sam out. OK, Benson, you were too nice. Huh? Why? What do you do? You know that school at sea contest last week? Yeah? Uh, Wendy. What about it? Uh, bye, Wendy. Freddie won it. No, no, I didn't. Yeah, you did. <laughs> no, Missy Robinson won it. No, Freddie won it, and then he told Principal Franklin he wanted to give it to Missy. <laughs> Sweet boy. <laughs> you gave up that cool trip just to get rid of Missy. I was protecting iCarly. <laughs> no, you care about Sam. <sighs> well, she was really upset. And you said Sam wasn't your friend. Yeah, whatever. And if that isn't a sign of friendship, we don't know what is. But that sign of friendship didn't last too long. You can't have frenemy without the enemy, right? Sam? Well, how can I pretend to have a crush on Freddy if I'm looking at his face? And that is certainly what Sam became when she told Webicon that Carly and Freddy were dating. All right, listen up! It's true, Carly and Freddy are deeply in love. Freddy does not look happy. Will you pull your head out of your fat shake and listen to me? What? Carly really likes that Adam guy, now he... Hey! Don't hate me! But after the truth comes out and everything is cleared up... And second... I was just messing with you guys when I said Carly and Freddy were in love. Wait! Joking? Yep. <laughs> she fell down collective legs. <laughs> and if he's not dating Carly, then he's got to be dating Sam. That's no, no, not no, no, true. Uh, yes! Sam and Freddy for the win! iCarly continues as normal. And so ends another edition of iCarly. I think we all learned a little something tonight. No, we didn't. Oh, that's right. We learned nothing. <laughs> we wasted your time. Bye! Later! Peace! And Sam and Freddy start getting close. 
Okay, what's up with you? What do you mean? You have been nice and helpful and considerate all day. <laughs> what's your game? No game. Why don't we get on with the project? Okay. Fair? Okay. Close enough that Freddy tries to help Sam with her crush. Uh, hey everyone. I, uh, I just saw a two-headed frog out in the courtyard. <laughs> Two heads on a frog. <laughs> Come on, I'll show you. Yes, follow Freddy. Come on. All right. Oh, uh, wait, don't go. Why not? We want to see the two-headed frog. Eh, Freddy exaggerated the, the number of heads. <laughs> but the joke is on Freddy, because Sam's real crush is Freddy. Look, I know it's scary for you to put your feelings out there, because you never know if the person you like is going to like you back. Everyone feels that way. But you never know what might happen if you don't looks like these frenemies may have finally dropped the enemy. Or maybe not. I'm waiting. Sam, I'm not buying you a ham. Oh, saying oh, oh, that I you could just, okay. buy oh, you oh, a so ham. If you could buy me ham, yes. that means you're going no, in the that I said it with a C, not a Come on. on. One thing we do know, no matter how Sam and Freddie define their relationship status. Give mama some sugar. Okay. There will always be a bit of arguing involved. I've met sure your mom. Got she kind she's of a obnoxious and she's rude. On, but my Harley has lived next she's to my mom insane. for years. Okay, there may be a lot to of arguing involved. To to Making the two of them forever frenemies. And we get it. You want to humiliate me on the web in front of millions of people? Go ahead and just do it. I don't care. Get back at me for all the mean things I've said.